What's up YouTube, this is Jesse Forfetti, and um, if you hear any loud sounds or music or talking in the background, that is why. That, well, that's actually a reflection of what's in front of me, but I'm actually at the theater right now. I just saw Sinister 2, and um, I'm here to do a review of it. I'm not doing the new, uh, Geek Gazette yet. I might do it like every other week or something, because I just really didn't have a whole lot to cover, but, um, and it just takes a while to make that one, because I have to find different topics that I did, and so I'm still going to try to upload stuff daily, and this might not go up until technically tomorrow, because it'll be past midnight my time, but, um, anyway, I saw Sinister 2, I had seen the first one, yes, and, um, Overall, in case you don't know what that is, you probably do if you're watching this. It is a horror slash thriller movie by Blumhouse Productions, and um, it's not—it's sort of scary. And it's a scary meter out of out of five, I'd probably give it a three and a half, maybe a bit closer to four, but. Um, it's not like boring or anything like the recent Poltergeist was, or Paranormal Activity or anything like that. It's better than that. But the thing that gets me for this movie is like the, or this series now, since there are two now, is that it's got like the. I want to know what is happening. I and mean, like you see what's happening, but you want to know why, what's causing it to happen, who this ghoul guy is that you see. And constantly throughout these movies, you, you want to know who he is. You know, he obviously has some connection to children. He's got like this, like following of by dead children. They're almost like his servants. It's really weird, but I. It's like really cool to me. I find it really interesting. So overall, I'd say when it comes to. Um, horror-wise, I give Sinister 2 out of 10. I'll give it a... Seven point eight. When it comes to plot, which includes, you know, just the story of it, um... Like connecting to the first one, obviously, it's probably around an 8.7. And overall, as an actual movie, rated about an 8.4. So, out of 10. And so, thank you so much for watching. That being said, please remember that my name is Jesse, and I would like you to like, comment, subscribe, and have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you.